you living in Ireland or the UK and hate the fact that we don't have visual voicemail, or live in the United States and your carrier doesn't support it? I'm Yulai Chang for GigaComedy.com and today I'm going to show you a free workaround. To get started, the application we're going to be using is Hulamail. So head on over to Hulamail.com and select your country. Then select Smart Voicemail and then select For You. Press Get Hula Mail and then select your platform. Hula Mail works on iPhones with iOS, Android, and Blackberry phones. I hope in the future Hula Mail is released on Windows Phone 7. So select your platform, in this case it's iOS, and we'll link you to iTunes where you can download Hula Mail. There's a free and a paid version. The main difference is the free version, a person can only leave a voice message about 90 seconds long, which I think is kind of very long anyway. But there's also advertisements on a free version, like, you know, ads from Google. However, the paid version is an annual subscription, so in this case, I mean, the free version will be fine unless you get, like, thousands of voicemails a day. So I want to install the app on your smartphone, launch it, and then press register. You'll be asked to fill in your username and password. Select the phone carrier along with your cell phone number and plan. So it can either be prepaid or contract. Once that's set up, it will install three numbers on your mobile phone address book. Like the phone says, it needs to be activated. Go to your contacts app and click Hula Mail Activate and then dial the number. It will display code which will show that your voicemail by your carrier like tree has diverted it to Hula Mail. So most is set up. Just leave a greeting message and when somebody can get through to you, they will be leaving a voicemail message with Hula Mail. Don't worry, Hula Mail is safe and secure. You will be notified through push notifications. And as soon as you open the app and click on the voicemail message, it'll start playing exactly like visual voicemail would do. This is a test from your visual voicemail. Well, you know, it's me talking to myself, but from a different phone, of course. And I should be waiting now any minute for Hula Mail to show a push notification, so I'm gonna hang up. You can play it on speaker, etc. What I love about Hula Mail over carriers, for example, is that you can email the voice message to yourself as Hula Mail completely digitizes everything. One thing Hula Mail notes is that it does use your data in minutes. It will use as many minutes as the voicemail lasts. For example, if someone leaves a 10 second voicemail, well that's 10 seconds off your call plan. Hula Mail also notes while it works with contract cell phone numbers, some carriers disable voicemail forwarding on prepaid cell phone numbers. Since my iPhone is on a contract, I've yet to find out what the stitch is in Ireland, but I'd imagine voicemail forwarding would work on prepaid phones. As an iPhone user, one thing I recommend doing is changing the push notification settings. I'd only ever get voicemails if it's something to do with like a delivery and I wasn't able to answer my phone, or if it was something important to like business, then I'd want a more prominent notification that I got a voicemail. So rather than the default ticker at the top of the iPhone, I went into settings and changed it from a banner ticker to a full alert. So there you have it. That's one more us Irish and British people can tick off the things that we don't have that America has. And if you're on Sprint, this is your workaround as well. Next up, Netflix, which is coming to Ireland and UK in 2012 anyway. I'm Lee Lloyd Chang for GeekyComedy.com and thanks for watching.